Whenever I hear people talk about the negativity of uh, traditional African spirituality, what we hear about is uh, voodoo, juju, obia, ifa. We hear all in a negative connotation. And the West is very good at demonizing us through their media. And, um, but one of the things we've got to admit is that because we sometimes move away from tradition and, and, and actually embrace superstitious beliefs as opposed to traditional scientific cultural beliefs, beliefs. And when I say scientific, I don't mean Western science. I'm talking about natural sciences. Because we kind of go towards the superstitious, we start to see spirit possession in everything, in children, in people who are doing well. And you know, what you'll find out is that because there's no rationale behind it, people sometimes get very angry, very volatile, sometimes very violent about the idea of a spirit coming in and taking over someone's body and using them to do evil deeds. When if you know, if you really research our traditions, you'll understand that we all have spirits inside us. Our ancestors are all around us. And so when we talk about spirit possession, what we're talking about is actually a spirit entering our body uninvited and refusing to vacate. Now that's something very hard to do. You really think about that when there's a spirit within us already. What we don't sometimes talk about is that some people just have bad spirits. And you can't exercise the bad spirit because they have a bad spirit inside them. It's their character. And it's the character of that spirit. But of course superstitious makes it easy for us to believe that someone else is responsible for someone doing bad deeds and it means that we can take away the responsibility from ourselves and give it to someone else this is very dangerous you know this can lead to deaths this can lead to abuse this can lead to you know backward steps in our in our community our global community so i know that spirit position is a very serious topic and i'm not trying to glib over it but i think we need to really understand how it's been abused and how superstitious beliefs are actually overtaking what i would call sometimes common sense